remember. <laughs> the Southern Copperhead is a brilliantly patterned pit viper of the southeastern United States. This snake is found throughout the coastal plain from eastern Texas to southeastern North Carolina and is still common in many of these areas. His close relatives, the northern copperhead, broad-banded copperhead, Osage, and Transpecos copperheads, can be found from west Texas through parts of the Great Plains up the Mississippi River Valley and over a large part of the Appalachian Mountain chain. The snakes you see today are all southern copperheads. Copperhead bites, although almost never fatal, still involve swelling, significant pain, nausea, and sometimes tissue destruction. Antivenom is only used sometimes in copperhead envenomations. The southern copperhead produces a venom long sought after by researchers. This venom contains an important protein called contortrostatin. Contortrostatin inhibits platelet aggregation and cellular adhesion. These properties have taken this protein into a variety of cancer research. Watch as the snake is gently captured and induced to bite. You will see a small amount of venom fall along the interior of the glass. It takes literally thousands of venom extractions to produce appreciable amounts of venom. After the snake is bitten, he will be returned to his clean enclosure, fed, and left alone for 14 days until his next venom extraction cycle. Yeah. I think we've done a couple of them. Yeah, I was 